So this concept of using reference points of 10, 5 and 1 percentage will help us a lot to calculate percentages much faster than using the conventional methods. Let's say we have to calculate 37 percentage of 6384. That's one scenario where this reference points is going to help us. Another scenario is when we are, let's say we are dealing with the problem and our profit is 2395 and our total sales or total turnover is 6435. So what would be a profit percentage if you want to calculate? We want to find out what percentage of 6435 is 2395. Here also we will be using the concept of reference points. But the slight difference here is here we would be looking at reference points of 50 percentage, 25 percentage, 50 percentage is half, 25 percentage is one fourth and so on. So let's find out 37 percentage of 6384. Now before we get to our reference points, the first thing that we normally do is to split this percentage. So here we have 37 percentage. So 37 percentage we can split it as 30 plus 5 plus 2. Now 30 is 3 into 10 percentage. Okay. 5 half of 10 percentage. And 2 is nothing but 2 into 1 percentage. So we can split 37 percentage in to this form wherein we have reference points of 10 again 5 which is half of 10 and 2 times 1. So first we will have to look at what is the percentage that we are trying to calculate. For example if we are trying to calculate 22 percentage then we don't need a 5 percentage. We can just do with 2 into 10 percentage plus 2 into 1 percentage. So in the case of 22 percentage we don't need to calculate 5 percentage. But if it's a 29 percentage, then yes. So we can split 29 as 2 into 10, which will give us 20 plus 5 plus 4 into 1. Or we can do a 3 into 10 minus 1 percentage. So depending upon your comfort level, you can use whichever reference point and then do the calculation. Now coming back to our 37 percentage. So we have split 37 as 30 plus 5 plus 2. So now let's fix the reference points for 6384. Now what is 10 percentage of 6384? 10 percentage is nothing but 1 by 10. So that is move one decimal place we get 10 percentage 638.4. Okay. Now. What is 5 percentage? 5 percentage is nothing but half of 10 percentage which is half of 6000 sorry 638.4 which is 319.2 and what is 1 percentage? 1 percentage is 1 by 100 we move 2 decimal places so 1 percentage is 60. 3.84. So now our 37 percentage is equal to 3 into 10 percentage. How much is 10 percentage? 638.4. Okay. Plus 5 percentage. What is 5 percentage? 319.2 plus 2 percentage. What is 2 percentage? 2 into 1 percentage which is 63.84. So this sum gives us 37 percentage. 
Now comparing this with the conventional method that we follow, that is 37 by 100 into 6384 and doing the multiplication, division and all those manipulations. One, it's going to take a lot of time, it's cumbersome and more the number of calculations you do, the more error prone it becomes. So this concept of reference points makes calculating percentages extremely easy.